the Israelis would say, well, look, you know, we are defending ourselves. We are targeting Hamas targets in Gaza. We are trying to put an end uh, to what we believe is a terrorist organization once and for all. Do you really keep a straight face when you say that? Do you think terrorist organizations embedded in populations who are denied their most basic rights are ended once and for all in a military campaign? Does that happen in history? Can someone credibly tell me that when the leadership of a country says, we are cutting off food, electricity, water, all supplies to an entire civilian population, that they're targeting militants? I'm sorry, these kind of lies can't be allowed to pass. Yeah. And when you tell yourself the lie, it leads to the wrong policy. If anyone told me <clears throat> that what the militants did on the weekend was a legitimate response to years and years of occupation, I would say, no, you're wrong-headed. You've lost sight of humanity and reality. And if anyone tells me that what Israel is doing in Gaza today is a legitimate response to what happened on the weekend, it's exactly the same. And yet they are saying it, and yet the international community is yes, saying and that. Yes, and people need to challenge them on it, because it's a lie.